Hey guys, so I went shopping today with um, a friend of mine who, um, well, she's not from my city, so whenever she comes to my city, we like um, go shopping, <laughs> or, you know, we just kind of make a day out of it. Um, yeah, but she's my, I call her my, like, half-cousin, um, because she's my dad's, um, like, like, he's her godfather, <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, she's, like, grown up, like, um, a bit older than me, but, so, we're, like, friends, but, yeah, anyway, <laughs> um, I got some stuff, um, yeah, and I'm gonna show you now, now I got some, like, clothing items, and one thing from MAC, um, that I've been wanting for a long time, and some other stuff. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna start with the clothing. So, first of all, I got socks. <laughs> Very boring, I know. Um, socks. And I think it's funny because, I don't know, they remind me of Victoria's Secret because of the love thing. Um, and it has all these colors. Um, yeah, and it's like seven pairs and it was only um, 17 Swiss francs, which it's about the same in dollars. Um, yeah, <laughs> and uh, you might think that that's a lot, but that's the G for like Swiss prices, um, for like seven pairs. So yeah. Anyway, it's boring. <laughs> um, okay, and then I got this shirt. Um, you can see that it's like a spaghetti top kind of and then it has like this little um ruffled detail detail right here and then it has this detail like around the edge if you can see that and also on the um on the things <laughs> on the what are they called? I don't know what they're called but yeah. Um on the drop, yeah. Um, so yeah, and it's like a salmon color, kind of. It might look pink, but it's kind of a salmon color, and it just has like black dots on it. And um, yeah, I don't know, I was just kind of in a spring mood. And this was 13 Swiss francs, which um, was from the same store where I got the socks. And the store is called um, New Yorker. Where I don't usually like shop there, but um, the f my friend she likes to shop there, and so it's always nice to go there and find things. So yeah. Um, then I got from this store called Tally Whale um, this shirt, which was 17 stuff. Um, like that. It's just a basic like long sleeve and like pink and grey stripes and um, it's just a round um, cup kind of um, and then it has these um, on the sleeve it's like kind of with the button thingy here so it's, it's very it's not a long long sleeve it's more for like kind of the beginning of spring, like when it's starting to get a little bit warmer, but it's not like warm enough to wear like short sleeves, um, so yeah, um, I really like this, um, yeah, and that's, I think that's everything I got for clothing, um, then I got, um, I guess I'll show you what I got from MAC next, um, I got the Studio Finish Concealer, which I just when I bought it, I was like, oh my god, it has like SPF 35, which is pretty, um, like a lot. <laughs> and like for a concealer, that's pretty nice, especially if you use it under your eyes. And I got the lightest color and in an NC and not an NW, and I felt that I would get the NW. Um, but this matched my skin perfectly, kind of. and. The guy who was helping me was, um, he said that you, which I heard that you have to do that, um, you have to match it up with your um, color on your neck, 
because the color on your neck is supposed to be the same color that is under your eyes. Something like that. Um, yeah, it's just to, supposed to be like the lightest shade of your skin. Like if you're gonna contour, like don't count that in. Just count in like, um, I don't know, like the bridge of your nose and just like the light areas of your face. They're supposed to match up with um, your neck um, skin tone. <laughs> So yeah, and we tried this one, and then we tried the, um, which was it, NW15, and then we also tried the, the one that I have in the other concealer, um, what was it, NW20, because I have the Select Moisture Cover, um, concealer in NW20, and so we thought that, you know, that it would be the same, but it's not, kind of. And I guess that the thing is that when I bought this one, it was April last year, um, I think it was April, um, and I think that the problem was that my skin was kind of getting tan, like just a tiny bit, um, yeah, and I'm kind of pale right now, like I'm, I'm wearing bronzer right now, that's how I look with bronzer, so, yeah, I'm kind of pale. <laughs> um, and yeah, and also this one is a lot more full coverage than this one, and my video is getting so long, sorry. This is a lot more coverage than this one, and so I think that it really needs to be like the exact same shade of your skin and not like, you know, something similar. So yeah. Uh, oh crap, okay. <laughs> it's alright. Um, so yeah, so it's NC15. Um, yeah. There's not much to show, it's just a flesh toned color. Um, yeah, and I'll have to like try it out with my foundation and stuff and see how it works. Um, yeah, so that's all. Then I got candles, which... Oh, they smell amazing. Um, which, I don't know if you know um, Fleur de Force on YouTube or from her blog. Um, she um, keeps talking about Yankee candles, which are these, you can read that, it says Yankee Candle on the top here, and I didn't know that we have them, but I saw them, and they're pretty expensive, like if you buy like a little jar thingy, it's like almost 30 bucks, I think, which is quite a lot, and these were, um, I think, fa 4 bucks each, so it's just nicer to like try them out, and I've never tried them before, and this one is Midsummer Night, no, Midsummer's Night, yeah, and um, it smells very fresh, kind of, I don't know how to explain it, I, I'm not good with scents, but this one is Vanilla Lime, which, it smells like vanilla, but it's more like, um, it's not that intense, because they have one that's called French vani Vanilla, I think, which I tried, and that was extremely, like, a lot of vanilla, so, yeah. Um, then I got this little thing, which I thought is so cute, and now I made sushi, I've been making sushi, like, not a lot, but more, like, at home, because it's cheaper, um, and I never had, like, something to put in, like, the little sauce thingy. I bought this little thing so that I can put in the sauce like the soy sauce with the wasabi, like mix. Um, yeah, that's everything I bought, um, like for the interesting stuff. I also bought like Greek yogurt and um, some of these mangoes, dried mangoes, which they're not sweet or anything, they're like pure dried mangoes, which they are delicious and um, yeah. Uh, yeah, so that's everything. Um, I hope you enjoyed my little haul. and. I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.